Well, it's late August and the fruit on the trees is getting mighty ripe. The birds been coming in, pecking on it. And we've started finding some little apricot pits down by the creek. I don't know how well you can see this, but there's a lot of pits from apricots down here that doesn't have any flesh left on the fruit at all. All the fruit was gone, so we know that's a little bit beyond the bird, so we wanted to find out what it was and put a top to it if we could, so we borrowed a little have a heart trap from the neighbor and uh, got it set up late in the evening because that seems to be, you know, when stuff comes out at night, you don't know what it is. So anyway, stay tuned and you can see what we catch. We got our trap set at about 10 p.m. Took one last look around and then went on to bed. Then about 11 p.m., we caught what we thought was our guilty party. But after further review of the trail cam, we saw another perpetrator on the scene. It was a beautiful black, very sleek bear that came to the apricot feast. The only thing is, I don't believe this raccoon enjoyed rubbing elbows with this big old black bear. <laughs> Look at that face. How could you not love that? <laughs> yeah, it was fun to see this pretty guy this morning on the video cam. Just wanting a little fruit. <laughs> In the end, our curiosity was laid to rest. And we decided to share some of our fruit trees with the wildlife. The interesting part was figuring out a way to let this pretty little guy go without him running up my dress. Which isn't the wisest thing to be wearing when you're dealing with wildlife, but had to figure out how to open that and then jump back away. Goodbye, little fella.